All right, my math lab number three. Change the percent to a decimal number. To change any percent, you just divide it by 100 because all percentages come out of 100. So if you have 2.55% of something, that's going to move this decimal point two places to the left. So that's going to be 0 0.0255. Because it was right here, 2.5, and it goes one, two places to the left. Um, this zero right here, um, I don't think in my math lab you have to type it in there. I normally do, but I don't think my math lab cares if it's in there or not. So you just need the 0 0.0255. Okay. Number six says write the decimal as a percent. So if you have seven holes and then another 0.28, all you have to do is take the 7.28 and multiply it times 100%. And that's gonna move the decimal two places to the right. Now, once it goes behind the eight, there's no other numbers. So it's just 728%. And yeah, it's possible to have more than 100%. Businesses do it all the time. like their profits increase by 350% from one year to the next. So it's possible to have percentages over 100. All right, number nine, find percent notation for the 5 sixteenths. So just take the 5 sixteenths, uh, punch a five in your calculator, then hit the division sign, and then hit um, 16. It's always the numerator divided by the denominator. And when I get to that, I get 0 0.3125. Now that converts it from a fraction to a decimal. To get it into percent form, you multiply it times 100%. That's going to take your decimal, which is right here, and move it two places to the right. So your final answer is going to be 31.25%. Don't forget the percent sign. Although my math lab might provide that for you, but if you had to write it out on paper, it wouldn't be there. And then when you get to number 13, now we're getting into those equations. Uh, boy, I wish I could remember what colors I used. I think I used purple, as I recall. Yes. I use purple for the word of and pink for is and it was yellow for the percentage and oh yeah yellow and blue make green and then this was blue <laughs> and the amount was green as I recall yep okay so just remember that um, your percentage here the nine point Two five percent you have to start by dividing that by 100 and that's going to change it to point zero nine two five and then you're going to multiply that remember that of means to multiply that is an awfully big x <laughs> sorry i'll just do it all in black that's going to be multiply times 180 and the is is your equal sign and the what i just use w for what 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 is 0 0.0925 times 188 so all you have to do on this one is multiply so grab your handy dandy calculator and do the multiplication and i get 17.39 now think about this um they only want 9.25%. That's less than 10% of 188 objects. I'd only have about 17 of them. That's not much. 9% is not much. 
All right, so those are the first four problems.